or Manuel Lafont. Rap Nui is head of the Paris office of the European Council on Foreign Relations, and he joins me now from the French capital. Thanks ever so much for joining us. Do you no expect any breakthroughs at this meeting? No, I don't think it's fair to expect any breakthrough. It's, as you just said, both uh, presidents are actually looking, well, looking forward to this meeting to get to know each other. It's more kind of establishing the relation rather than really finding solution. But how do you think the two men might get along, especially since Putin actively backed Marine Le Pen, didn't he, during the presidential campaign? He backed Marine Le Pen and quite a few other candidates, actually. He was also in favour of François Fillon. And we're not sure that Jean-Luc Mélenchon would have displeased him. And Emmanuel Macron was really the one candidate that he was not really fond of. But I think that um, this, for, for both uh, of them, for both Putin and Macron, this is past. Now they have a relation, a bilateral relation to build. And actually, during the campaign, even though he was having quite a very strong language on the relation with Russia, Macron was insisting that he wanted a dialogue to be established with Putin personally. Uh, so quickly is, is a sign of the willingness on both sides to have this kind of uh, personal relation, relation sorry, as fast as possible. If they are going to have a future in terms of France and Russia moving ahead together, what are the, the bones of contention? What are those main sticking points that they'll have to deal with, first of all? You have two major crises which they've discussed, uh, and, and they have addressed them at the beginning. At, at least President Macron has addressed them at the beginning of the press conference, which is going on. It's Syria, which is the real priority for the French. And it's also Ukraine, and the French are involved in the so-called Normandy format or Minsk process with the Germans, with Berlin, to try to find a solution in Ukraine. These are the two really difficult issues on which there hasn't been a lot of progress uh, recently as far as the European interests are, are concerned. Uh, and, and these are the kind of two obstacles to a more, to a broader uh, um, better, improved bilateral relationship. Well, the two men meeting, hoping to improve relations between France and Russia, and we're better than at the Palace of Versailles, where the Hermitage exhibition is taking place very soon. Well, thank you very much for your insight.